What's going on, everybody? Welcome to another ANR, not a review. We are doing a top five Star Wars countdown of figures that we want in celebration of Hasbro Pulse 2021. These are five figures that I would personally love to see Hasbro announce. They're not in any particular order, they're just five figures that I want. Before I count down these five figures, if you're not a subscriber and you're watching this video, click on that subscribe button and leave a comment on our videos because you have a chance to win a prize every month. But if you're not a subscriber, you're not gonna win those cool prizes. Number five on my list is Pong Krill. This guy is eight feet tall, got four hands, and wields dual lightsabers. What's really cool about this guy is he started out as a Jedi, but then fell into the dark side with Doku and became a badass villain. Now, this guy is such a unique character. I would love to get this guy in my collection. Number four on my list is the Dark Troopers from the Mandalorian TV series. We all got to see it. It was such a badass moment when they were lined up, turned on, and eventually punching their way through walls and the Mandalorian's armor. It is gonna be so cool to army build these guys. I really hope they don't become an exclusive to Walmart or anything nonsense like that. Make sure they're readily available so we can army build to our delights. Number three on my list is Asian Callus from the Rebels animation. I really enjoyed watching this TV show. It's on the Disney Plus. You can check it out if you want to. But this character is such a cool character. It's such a unique story arc to this character from beginning to end of the show. And I hope that we get this guy to complete our Rebels figures that we got a couple years ago and to round it off. And he just he would just fit right in there with Zeb, Zabin, and you know Ezra, all these characters. So yeah, Agent Callus will be a nice addition to our collection. Number two on my list is Ayla Secura. Trained by Quinlan Voss, she is a deadly fighter, a beautiful deadly looking fighter, one that we should have already had in our Star Wars Black Series collection. So I'm hoping Hasbro finally makes this character because there's a lot of customs out there that look cool, but I want the official one done by Hasbro very soon. So please Hasbro, make it happen, and I would love to have this figure in my collection. Number one on my list is Savage Opress, brother of Maul and servant of Ventress. Both characters that we already got in Black Series, we just need the brother there, Opress, and it'd be cool to have these guys, you know, standing alongside in my collection. And I and I think for a lot of Star Wars fans, they would appreciate getting this figure. So, Star Wars Black Series guys, stop making repaints of the same characters over and over again. Let's get some new characters going. I hope you guys liked my top five Star Wars figures for Black Series. And if you're watching this for the first time and you haven't subscribed, make sure to subscribe, just like all subscribers here. They leave a comment every month and they get a chance to win a prize. So go ahead, subscribe, leave a comment, and have a chance to win a prize every month. As always, thank you for watching. Take a look at some of our other top five videos that we have, the G.I. Joe and the Marvel Legends. And let's enjoy Hasbro Pulse 2021. Take care.